It's time for another one of these things, whatever you want to call it. Oh, we didn't uh, turn on the Christmas tree. That is, that is rude of us. Anyway, look at all these gifts. I still have to wrap a bunch more, but you might be wondering, why do you not have your gifts under the tree? Well, there's a very good reason for that. And the reason, the reason is sitting right over here. This right here, this face, come here, Daisy. This is the reason the gift can't be under the tree. We caught her, we actually had a few gifts, gifts under the tree, and we caught her chewing on one of the corners of the gifts. So um, rather than let her chew up all of the gifts, we decided just to remove them. She's got no discipline. I don't know how to, how to deal with this puppy. If anybody wants her, you can have her. Just kidding. <laughs> but yeah, that's why the tree or the gifts aren't under the tree. Um, speaking of which, I got to light it up. There we go. Much better. Check out those stockings right there. They are stuffed. The middle one is for the puppies. The one on the right is for someone. And the one on the left is for me. I can't say your name, so I have to say someone. What? What? Do you, what? What? What is it? Cut. Cut. I'm not cutting anything. Wait, what was the name you wanted us to? <laughs> the one on the left is for me. The one on the right is for Nighthawk. <laughs> that's. I think that's the name we're going with. Nighthawk. Ooh. I like it. What was that? It's a little. A little Whoa, that's, oh, okay. I thought you were taking out some for me. That's for mine. <laughs> so we're having some, uh, what is that, cookie dough ice cream? Yeah. Yeah. I just want, I don't want that, I don't want nearly that much. It's still for me. <laughs> You're still not done? Oh, that's a lot. Okay. I need an ice cream scooper. I'll I need to buy you. an ice cream scooper. In addition to cookie dough ice cream, we're going with some hot chocolate. Tis the season, right? Right? Preach. <laughs> But she puts uh, whipped cream in hers. Watch this. Watch your skills with whipped cream. This is ridiculous. Yeah, because I'm not new. Because you're not new. You've been doing this your whole life. Look at... Oh, okay. <laughs> I got a little, I got a little messy. I got a little messy. I'd like to take this opportunity to wish everyone a Merry, Merry Christmas. Um, hopefully everybody's doing okay. There's some noise happening in the background. Okay. <laughs> Always trying to cause the distraction. Look at Daisy. Okay, Daisy, uh, da Daisy, I'm really bad with this. Here, let me, let me focus on her. There she is. She's ready to protect me from whatever was happening there. Um, also, you guys haven't seen the tiny tank that I, uh, I guess, uh, aquascaped is the technical term for it, um, in the last video, so here it is. It's coming along nicely. There's a whole lot of growth. There are some snails in here. There's three of them. Um, and then there's my beta Ozzy that I moved from his previous tank. Where is he at? Where are you at, Ozmeister? Do you guys see him? He's probably hiding right now. He's a little camera shy. I never ask his permission to film him either, so um, that's always a problem. But the tank is coming along nicely. You can see the plants are growing in really, really well. Well, it's been like maybe two weeks since the vlog. So uh, not a whole lot of time has passed. And these plants are thriving. There are a lot of roots happening. But oh, he's down there. I just saw him. I just saw him. Here he comes. Here he comes. Let you see him right there. Oh, right there. You see him under the under the wood there? Maybe not. He's he's pretty shy. Anyway, uh, I'm seeing if he'll come out, but he won't. Yeah, the plants are coming along nicely. There he comes. Oh, Ozzy. Say hello to the people. Okay, back down he goes. It's looking great. Gonna wrap a couple of gifts here. This is a singing machine. This is for my goddaughter, Audrey. Hopefully by the time she sees this, she will have already opened this gift. Audrey, if you're watching this video, this thing is for you to sing. So your parents gotta plug it in and let you sing real, real loud and whenever you want. I'm sure they're gonna really appreciate that. It's a, it's a pretty big gift, so hopefully I can get it wrapped nicely. Hmm, it's pretty good cut in there. Kind of a jagged edge, but it's not that bad. That's some good shellac you got there on those nails. <laughs> okay, we got we got the paper cut to size. Let's fold that that over. There you go. Perfect. I probably should be helping with this, right? Wait, this one's straighter, I think. Yeah, probably. You're so good at folding. I am. I'm a good folder. I'm a good wrapper. That's why you're good at laundry. That's why I was a wrapping champion of Canada 2015 and four years running before that. Four yeah. years in a row, rapping champion. What was your uh, rap nickname? MC Daddy Longnuts. 
Dan, Dan the Dinner Man. That's a good rhyme you got there. I'm gonna use that in one of my songs. I'm Dan, Dan the Dinner Man. And that's all I got. <laughs> were you waiting for like more? I think you were waiting for more. Oh no! No! Hold on, I can save this. There we go. Okay, that's better. You it's made a gonna, mess! I did make a mess. It's not gonna be visible. Audrey, if you're watching this, I'm sorry. I did make a mess. What is happening here? I blame you. Why? Because uh, you were responsible for these edges. No, you weren't. I'm just kidding. And then like this. The first... Oh, what is happening here today? The first ones are always the tough ones because you can't you can't really like sit it down. Look at that. Oh, look at that. I bet you're so jealous right now. Are you learning a little something? Take notes. I'm gonna actually tape this one down. Make sure that it's nicely taped. Mm -hmm. And mmm. Not too shabby. I don't claim to be the best. How is it uneven? Shh, because this part isn't in the middle. See that? It's supposed to be in the middle. Oh. See how it's a little bit off? It's not bad though. I don't claim to be the best at rapping. I just claim to be the second best behind Martha Stewart. Martha's the best rapper. Best rapper alive. There we go. All done. Audrey, this is for you. And you will have opened it by the time you see this, I hope. He's out. I caught him. Ha, Ozzy, you're a star now, Ozzy, you're a star. Bubba and Daisy playing with the uh, the cardboard uh, inner tubes of the wrapping paper. Bubba, <laughs> he's too lazy to get up and get the rest. Daisy, can you bring it over for him? Nope. <laughs> Next up. We're gingerbread housing. We got a kit though. It's not gonna be like one of those massive gingerbread houses, but we got extra candy just so we can decorate it a little bit better. And this is what we have to work with. The house parts along with, I guess, some trees and some gingerbread dudes. And we got a little bit of candy here. We got some, some icing just slapped down on the table um, and more candy. And then we've got this. This is what we use, I guess, to stand everything on. Kind of a convenient little kit. Hopefully it all works out. It seems, it seems like pretty flimsy. I don't know if this is gonna hold it or not. We'll see, only time will tell. What's, is this for like the path? Are we supposed to actually decorate the path too? You can use your imagination. We've got walls. It's kind of a, yeah. I was gonna say it's a sloppy job, but it's not a sloppy job, it looks great. It looks great. Don't be angry. I didn't say it. Oh, you did. Okay. You did the wrong side on that one. No. Yeah. You put it on this side. Yeah. There you go. Put it on that. Yeah. You want to do it? No, it's fine. I sing that roof. Yeah. Oh, that's stripping off the edge. It's kind of done. I mean, we kind of cheated. We didn't bake the gingerbread pieces ourselves. It was a whole kit, but we still managed to mess it up. Like, look at those gaps. That is not a well-insulated home right there. Look at that. There's, there's, there's a, lot of, a lot of drafts for coming into this house. Anyway, this is going to be um, Nighthawk's side. Wait, what was your name again? Dragon Face? Nighthawk? Nightshade? You're just trying to call me nasty names. <laughs> no, I'm not. That's um, Chicken Hawk's. I don't. What's the <laughs> what's the name you wanted to go with? Why chicken? Because the chicken hawk is a thing. Anyway, then this is my side. We're gonna see who decorates it better. Because everything. Oh man! But thing. look at this wall, though. Here we go. This is my side. I have not seen her side yet. But do you want to see my side? <laughs> what? What's so funny? It looks amazing. Does it though? That's craftsmanship. It's pretty good, right? If you weren't sitting here, I would have assumed that you had a child do that. <laughs> to be honest. A with really you. talented child. <laughs> okay, let's check out yours. By the way, these were also my idea right here. These little these little beads up top here, right there. These are all mine. Okay, here we go. 
This is gonna be ridiculous. I just know it just from the look on your face. <laughs> I'm Dan the Dinner Man. <laughs> what is that? What does that even mean? You know what it means. <laughs> uh, very nice printing. Thanks. Oh my god. This is what we got so far. Uh, let's not show them that side again. That's a weird side. Check it out. Oh, yeah. Looking good. There's the front door and the windows. We got one of those. We've got... Oh, the chimney just went on. Is it going to stay? Or are you going to hold it? It has to dry still. Okay, I just want to show it. them the back. Okay. Is it going to fall off if I do this? No. Oh, careful. It's a little bit crooked. Hey, let's check it out. We got a back door. It's labeled back door. Just in case we forget that it's the back door. I got the Christmas tree all decorated. I just got to stick it on the um, I, uh, plastic base. Is that chimney stuck yet? I don't know. There's my little guy. I gave him a beard. He's supposed to be Santa. Um, it was a pretty, pretty sad looking Santa. And there's a little blue eyed guy behind him just hanging out. Looking all adorable and stuff with his little haircut. And his little gloves. And the tree is now standing beside the house. We're just about done. We've got some finishing touches. Look at these roofs again. Mine, I mean, the more I look at it, the more it looks like some sort of a torture. It just looks dangerous, my roof. And then, of course, okay. But there it is. It's looking pretty good. The final product. I think it looks amazing, and you did a great job, Night Terror. <laughs> <laughs> is that the name we're going with? I keep forgetting the name we're going with. It looks it great. No, that's not true. We got a little path, like a, a silver ball path. And this looks kind of like a little campfire or something. And then she added some big balls up at the top um, next to my name. So that's kind of cool. Anyway, yeah, look at that. Looks great. It's the next morning, and uh, I've got to head up to uh, close to Barrie today to visit my cousin. It's, a, it's about an hour drive away. And the weather, I don't know if it could pick up really well on the camera, but the weather is not, the weather outside is frightful, I should I should say. Uh, Tis the season not to drive is another thing I should say. But anyway, I got to drive about an hour, go drop off my, uh, my god, one of my goddaughters, one, a goddaughter for one, a gift for one of my goddaughters, because I got another one who's in Toronto. Um, I'm not looking forward to this drive, but uh, you got to do what you got to do. And then she just, she just has she just got a brand new little baby brother and i'm um, get, getting him some stuff too hopefully he likes it but yeah look at this i'm really really not looking forward to this i haven't even put my winter tires on yet but before i can even leave my driveway i've got to do something that a lot of you think is fun i've got to shovel this driveway Okay, the driveway has been shoveled. Um, I went and got a couple supplies. I loaded up the gifts into my car. I came and met Rui. <laughs> and we're driving up to my cousin's place now to drop off some gifts uh, for uh, my goddaughter, Audrey, and I guess my cousin. She has a little brother, like I mentioned. And I guess he's my cousin, I guess, right? Second, second cousin. cousin. Yeah. But the second cousin is Rui's godson. Yeah, so yeah. Rui's got a vested interest in this too. That's why we're going up together. He's driving. I still don't have my winters on. Like I said, uh, this is a lot safer. <laughs> and uh, he's a much safer driver than I am. So hopefully we'll be there in maybe 40 or so minutes, hang out a little bit, and then come back home and get ready for tomorrow's um, festivities, which uh, I don't know if I mentioned to you guys, but I'm hosting at my place, and I'm going to do a whole lot of cooking. And I don't know how that's going to go. We'll see. Hopefully everything goes according to plan. Finally got to our exit. It's been probably only 40 minutes. We've been making good time. Ooh, it's really dark. Can you even see your... Ah, there he is. There's a beautiful face. <laughs> uh, we delivered the gifts. Uh, she actually opened the gifts, which was great. I wasn't expecting her to open them. Uh, so I got to see her. I got to see her sing Let It Go. <laughs> I got some video of that. I'm not going to show you guys, though. Personal moment. She's not ready for the spotlight just yet. She will be soon. Uh, but now we're going to drive back down. To Toronto and then I'm gonna take a nap 
Actually, I'm going to sleep, not take a nap. And tomorrow morning, that's when I start getting ready for uh, Christmas Eve dinner. It's going to be quite the adventure. I'm cooking all the things. So, yeah. Uh, I'm not the guinea pig. <laughs> no, you're not. You have your own Christmas Eve thing yes, going on. Yes, I do. Yeah, so we'll see. Hopefully, the drive down is good. It's really snowy outside, but it should be all right. It is December the 24th, Christmas Eve. These little guys are in prison. We're gonna let them out shortly, but I had to put them in here so I can clean up. Um, there's our Christmas tree with all the gifts underneath. Some of them are for me, most of them are for everybody else. Uh, I now have to start the process of cooking for everybody. Oh, also on TV, Home Alone, a holiday classic. But last night, actually I wanna show you guys something cool that we saw last night, check this out. Starting on the roast beef, this is what I want to put in a, in a pan, all these veggies here. And then I'm going to put this bad boy. Oh, look at this thing. It looks delicious. I'm going to probably debone it and then tie it around with some butcher string. And we're going to place the vegetables. This is a Jamie Oliver recipe, by the way. <laughs> I'm going to place the vegetables right there. And then we're going to put this on top of the veggies and put it right in the oven. And it goes in for like an hour and uh, an hour and a bit. Hopefully all goes well. Um, so far, uh, I'm just chopping. Look at this hunk of beef right here. It's ready for the oven, but we're not quite ready to have it in the oven. So it's gonna hang out here for a bit. Now I'm gonna work on the salad. People are set. People are here. Isaiah. <laughs> Bubba, what is, what's on the floor? Oh, he ate it up. Hi. Hi. Yeah. Ready? Oh my goodness! <laughs> she's like lifts her little eyebrow. What is that? Ooh. Oh, you lost your cell phone. <laughs> What's this? Oh, see, I love it. Oh, oh, oh. Hello? Hello? Who is it? It's for you. <laughs> oh my goodness! How did you do Wow! <laughs> oh my goodness! You have a microwave! It's so cute! She's good. <laughs> wow, what's that? It's hard from Bedrino. <gasps> Do these things turn to? Oh my yeah. god! Oh my god, this is so cute! Look, Mama! Oh my god, a cutting board! There's the pots and pans in the next one, I think, too. This is ridiculous, actually. That's the instructions in case you need them. Oh, she's gonna wanna play with this for sure. Mama, mommy. Look, she's like. Oh, say hello. Who is it? I'm busy. I'm cooking. Hello. Oh, he's so cute. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Little frying pan. Wow. Oh my goodness! She puts the phone in the sink. Look, she's gonna make some food right now. <laughs> she's stirring. <laughs> oh, yummy! Nice! <laughs> oh, so cute! Oh, look at that. That was Isla opening up her gift from me. It's a little kitchen. She seemed to really, really enjoy it. She spent the rest of the night banging around pots and pans and stuff. And then, um, Chicken Hawk over there, got her some uh, some like fake foods for her, uh, for her to play in her kitchen with. Like you gotta have some fake food and stuff. And Christmas, Christmas Eve overall was great. Everybody liked the food. Um, everybody had a good time, I think. Christmas day, Christmas morning, I should say, which by the way, today is the 25th of December. Um, well, look at Daisy over there. Can you see her over there? She's playing with one of her gifts. <laughs> this place is a mess, we need to clean up. Uh, but yeah. So today we're going to, um, I should say, I got some great gifts this morning as well. Uh, we got, uh, well, I'm not going to go into detail, but it was great stuff and I really, really enjoyed all the things I got. And I really enjoyed the fact that the people I got things for enjoyed them as well. That's better. That's even better than getting awesome gifts is giving. Giving is better. Shut up. Giving Get is. Out. That's all you can Giving is better than receiving, guys. <laughs> um, but today we're gonna we're gonna get ready to go visit um, uh, Chicken Tendy's 
mom. <laughs> I don't know what to call her. Well, she's going to have a new nickname every time we, we do one of these things. So we're going to go visit her mom today. Um, it's going to be a bit of a drive. It snowed a lot. I don't know if you guys can see outside. Let me see if... Can you, can you focus on that? Let me see if I can like... Ah, it's really tough to focus. Oh, there we go. You can't really tell, but it snowed a lot overnight. We were supposed to get like 15 to 20 centimeters. And I think we did. Ooh, is it going to brighten me up now? It is. Um, so it's going to be a hectic drive, but it should be a really nice drive. It looks really nice outside. Here, let me show you. That is the road currently. It looks nasty. Um, <laughs> the plows are out, that's for sure. But there's a lot of snow everywhere. It's going to be a lot of fun, though to see all this, especially on the long drive. Why is this guy getting out of his car right now? What's going on here? I'm looking through my uh, my blinds. I kind of look like a creep. This guy's just getting out of his car right in front of my house. What are you doing, dude? Where's he going? Ah, he's walking across the road. Yep, there he goes. Here we go, off to Guelph. Um, chicken dinner is just coming around to the car. I'm not sure what she's doing, she's checking her car. Uh, anyway, it is so bad out here. I still don't have my winners on. This is going to be a very careful drive. I'm sorry for the Christmas music in the background. There we go. Um, it's going to be an interesting time. Hopefully it all goes smoothly. Right? Right? It's freezing. Yeah, it is cold. And it's very snowy. Anyway, wish us luck on this nice, long, uh, snowy drive. Speeders. Talk to me. What do you want to know? Stuff. What kind of stuff? And that's a wrap for this holiday vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, on another note, uh, just a kind of a, not really an announcement, but just a heads up. I know I haven't been posting a lot of uh, islands lately, and I know I haven't been posting a lot of Minecraft at all lately. There's a very good reason for that. I'm tired of like modded Minecraft and single player slash multiplayer Minecraft here and there. I'm going to start a new Minecraft series. There's going to be a bit of a twist. I think you guys will enjoy it. Um, but it's just going to be one series, probably only once a week. And Wylands, Islands, whatever you want to call it, that's another one that I'm going to start up very, very soon from scratch because now that I know all the game mechanics, I feel like I could have done a lot of things better. It's going to start up again. Look for it in the new year or close to the new year. Maybe I might even get to it this week, but probably in the new year, more likely. Um, like early, early January, first or second, no, not much later than that. Um, you're going to want to keep an eye out for those series because those are going to be pretty uh, different. They're going to be pretty cool. <laughs> I hope you'll enjoy them. But anyway, thank you so much for watching this vlog. Uh, please remember to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Oh, and I also just, everybody keeps asking me, what happened to all your subscribers? Because I turned the subscriber numbers off. Um, in this day and age, with YouTube, with the YouTube landscape as it is currently, subscriber numbers aren't important anymore like people only watch what they're interested in they aren't really like i've got a, almost one point and, and subscribers are still going up for me like every day i gain subscribers i'm not actually losing any subscribers which is interesting to me because not as many people are viewing videos but i find that's the case for video game uh let's players um sort of gaming related channels in general there are only a few that are gaining views. Most of them are losing views and I'm not sure why that is. Maybe there's a shift in focus um, on the YouTube search page or something like that. No idea. Either way, I'm still going to continue to do what I do. I turned off the subscriber numbers just because I don't really care about subscriber numbers anymore. What I am interested in is uh, the people that are watching my videos, whether that be 20,000, 30,000, 5,000. I want to focus on those people, not the other people who are subscribed but not really watching. So that's why I turned them off. Not really a big deal to me. Um, and this is just to answer any questions because I've seen I've seen comments like what happened to all your subscribers? Um, they're all still there. <laughs> it's just that the numbers are hidden now because it really serves no purpose in uh, in indicating how well a channel is doing. I want to see how many people are watching my videos. So that's just a distraction for me and I don't need it there. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Click the like button. Subscribe if you haven't already to be notified of my videos. Um, but you have to actually watch them. <laughs> don't just subscribe and then not watch them if you're not going to watch them. Don't subscribe. Anyway, hope everybody had a very happy um, couple days. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas. All that wonderful stuff. And I'll see you again very, very soon. And some really cool stuff coming up. Really cool stuff coming up on the channel um, within a couple weeks at the most. Bye-bye.